Welcome to Volume 1. Volumes are a series that we'll be dropping here, sharing with you the updates we've made on Tempo. Each volume will contain tracks. Tracks are basically updates we've made, and you can think of volumes as our mixtape. And this is Volume 1. For Track 1, we have Import GitHub Repos. A lot of people have requested this because although Tempo is great to start your project, maybe you already have a project you started with. And that's what Import GitHub Repos helps you with. You can import your existing project and continue to build off that. And then we have track two. For track two, we have what we call local mode. I don't know if you've seen this, but a lot of people's workflows today consists of them starting with an AI code gem tool and then moving to their favorite ID, whether it be Windsurf, Cursor, or VS Code. You can now easily do that with Tempo's local mode. All you have to do is click on the VS Code icon on Tempo, and then it will sync to your favorite IDE, giving you the ability to continue your project on your IDE of choice and picking back right into Tempo. This makes it great for collaboration or switching your environments to develop your projects. And for track three, we have custom knowledge. AI goes bonkers sometimes. COD 3.7 cannot be controlled. With custom knowledge, you can give precise instructions like the tech stack you're using, your design system, or whatever information you want the AI model to always remember. This allows for the outputs to be better and for you to have a better experience building using AI. And the next few updates are a medley of tracks. We're talking environment variables in a chat. No longer will you be pushing your sensitive environment variables to the AI model. We have a beautiful way of handling that. Git organizations. Tempo is not just for individuals, but also for companies. So you can push and pull from your GitHub organization account, not just your personal GitHub. Expo V2, we launched V1 a couple weeks ago. V2 is out now. And what's cool about it, it's fast, fast, fast. You can now develop your mobile applications fast using Tempo. And who doesn't love performance improvements, which is what we've made on Tempo. Tempo is generally faster to use and build applications with. You can also now download your code base in a zip file. If you want to, you can, you have that freedom. And last but not least, sometimes unplugging the machine and plugging it back in is what's going to fix it. Same with your Tempo projects, you now have a restart button. Sometimes restarting your server will probably fix the bug you're experiencing. So ladies and gentlemen, this is volume one. We're super excited to see what you build with all the improvements we made to Tempo, and we can't wait to see you at volume two. Happy building.